Okay, so let's dish out the latest scoop on Jennifer Lopez and Ben Affleck. They've been strutting around town with smiles plastered on their faces, but hey, there's a thunderstorm brewing over their heads. Buckle up, because we're about to spill the tea. Apparently, J-Lo wants to safeguard her fortune from any potential fallout with Ben Affleck. She's urging him to sign a post-nup. Yep, you heard that right, a post-nup agreement. It's like a prenup, but it's signed after the I do's. Now hold your breath. Jennifer Lopez, with a net worth of a staggering $400 million, doesn't want to take any risks with her hard-earned dough. Meanwhile, Ben's bank account falls way behind at $200 million. Wow, Ben, you're practically a pauper in comparison? You might be thinking, if she trusts him, why the need for a post-nup? Great question. According to insiders, J-Lo's got a gut feeling that Ben won't leave her high and dry if things go south. But hey, better safe than sorry, right? With so much moolah at stake, J-Lo's not taking any chances. Now let me drop some knowledge on you. This Hollywood power couple isn't alone in this post-nup craze. Apparently it's not uncommon for these formal documents to pop up a year or two into a marriage. They're being sensible, but man, it's not exactly the dream scenario after so much tension and trouble. And here's the kicker, they've been parading around all smiles, but behind the scenes, it seems like the honeymoon phase might be over. Awkward. There have been rumors of some tense arguments, including an incident during the premiere of J. Lo's latest release, The Mother. Ben was caught on camera arguing with her while they were supposed to be posing for snaps. Oops, but wait, there's more. After Lopez hopped into the car, Affleck slammed the door with a hint of irritation. Can't blame the guy though, paparazzi are relentless. Those flashes can make even the happiest couple a tad grumpy. Now here's a plot twist. They're apparently renewing their wedding vows on their first anniversary. Looks like they're trying to prove to the world that they're still going strong amidst all the speculation. Will it work? Who knows? So my take on this whirlwind romance? Well, true happiness can't be bought, folks. It's not about finding an equal match or having a fortune. These two have a lot on their plates and sometimes pressure can burst the pipes if you catch my drift. All right, folks. Keep your eyes peeled for more updates. Like, comment, subscribe, do all the good stuff. Catch you on the flip side.